the root of the word sabbatical is basically the same as Sabbath. It's, it's to rest. So as we start talking about, uh, about what this sabbatical was like, um, that's probably the place to start is I think the first duty of any minister going on sabbatical to, uh, to catch up on sleep and also do all of the, the pieces of resting body, mind, and soul um, that you might not have a chance to do in, in day-to-day life. So I've been doing that quite a bit. And that's not the same as saying um, be sedentary, especially um, not, not for me. I've spent a lot of time in the last couple months walking. Um, you may have seen on Facebook back in March, I walked the West Highland Way, uh, which is about 100 miles um, up here in Scotland. Then in, um, in April, Stacy and I walked uh, the North Downs Way from our house in Seven Oaks to Canterbury following the old pilgrimage path. And now, um, in this... <laughs> This week between um, Stacy and Ailish going home and uh, and General Assembly starting, um, I am um, back up in Scotland walking the the Great Glen Way, which runs um, from Glasgow, which is down that way. That's uh, the Ben Nevis Range right behind me, um, up to Inverness, which is that away, about uh, about eighty miles total. Um, the Great Glen is actually a fault line. It's, it's, a, it's an almost straight line um, that's, that's a series of locks and canals uh, all the way across Scotland from, from the, the southeast, southwest to the northeast. Um, it's good, you know, walking, walking is a good opportunity to think um, and to just be present in the moment. It also is true that I sleep better after walking 15 miles than about any other time in my life. So we'll talk more about um, more interesting pieces of the sabbatical tomorrow. Um, but for right now, that's that's what I'm doing, and that's why the, the um, backgrounds behind me for the next couple days are going to be out here in the wilderness. See you tomorrow, everybody.